In Merlin, the IBMI Project Explorer view provides a way to associate your projects with an IBMI. Underneath the project, it will list the IBMI, and if it's not specified, you can click on the plus sign to see the list of templates that have been defined in Merlin that you can select from. Once you have selected a template, then a connection will be made to that IBMI using that Merlin template and its credentials. For a project, there is metadata associated with it. In this particular project, the metadata includes a variable that needs to have a value specified. So there is an object live variable and we're going to need to give it a value. So to look at that metadata, inside the project there's a file called iproj.json. So for this object live variable, we are going to give it a value and then the connection will be established. With that connection established, you can expand the library list to see your connection environment. And also there is an object libraries query so you can see the libraries associated with this project. You can expand into them and see its objects. There's also a my queries. So here you can define additional queries to see objects on the IBMI. You can specify a library name or some other QSys query, and then you can see the objects under QSys. On those objects, you can do some actions, such as delete and uh, library list changes. Uh, also under my queries, you can specify an IFS query to see files on your on the IFS. You can expand into that and drill down and see all those uh, files. Underneath the project, there's also the source field. This is showing you the associated IFS directory on the I where source will get built and also how these associated files on the workspace compare to the files on the IFS. You will make some changes typically on the, I, on the workspace and then push them up to the IFS. You can see uh, the differences between the IFS and the workspace using this change filter. Normally it shows all the files that are on the workspace and in the IFS.